Hi everybody, this is Phil again with a new video. I'm drawing my character Jennifer again. I did a pinup of her not long ago, maybe a couple months ago. Her, she was wearing a blue, kind of a blue nighty. Her hair is all down, and uh, she's holding one of her weapons that she has in the story I've been working on outlining as a um, story I want to work on after the uh, books I write here with the my current um, plot. But um, yeah, I'm drawing her again. I figured I'll do a little um, different design with her hair and pose. And, but I just, I, I don't know, I, the com color combinations of her green eyes, gray hair, and the spots that my youngest kind of thinks are giraffe spots. Even though um, it just um, assigns her as um, part dragon, the scaly, type um, spots, but um, I, yeah, I just time I, I went with a new um, pinup picture of her, just because she's um, just just nice to draw. Uh, I got about three three new pictures that I've just scanned in this past weekend that I am going to um, work on also. Uh, a witch holding a her wand and in her other hand has a spider that's crawling across her hand, and a picture of Chi from the Chobit series in Japan. I've I, drawn her a couple times, but never actually um, done anything for her YouTube, so um, she's going to get colored here pretty soon. Um, that, that one came out really good, the Chi. And a third picture with... Um, Poor girl eating an ice cream and trying to get it to her mouth, it drops and falls on her shirt. So, yeah, poor girl got her ice cream falling and the expression on her face just shows you how upset she is. But those, um, probably within the next day or so, I'm going to be working on those in between um, writing and work and whatnot. Um, also, I got um, some ideas. I'm going to be doing some videos for how I color. Can I maybe do a small series of that? Uh, coloring skin, coloring um, clothes, um, how, how I actually do things. And I'm thinking about making another series with um, how to draw, how I do from kind of a start to finish, kind of like I did with the um, um, elf I did about two months ago also. I did a, th a three-parter on that. And, um, like, and there's, a, there's a few ideas in the works right now. Um, like I, got, I got pictures, things that are going to get done, and it just takes time in between what I'm doing. I should have a little, a little time to get the colorings done over the Thanksgiving weekend since I have uh, quite a few days off. Um, the I think I'm I think I'm gonna work on Chi first since the witch was a Halloween picture that I never uh, finished in time, but it, that one came out really good also. <clears throat> Had to do a little um, touch-ups on it, but um, all in all, it came out better than I expected. <clears throat> Sorry about the throat a little bit. Um, Michigan weather gotta love the changes. Hot, cold, 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 hot. So, yeah, it's hard. It's hard to stay well when you're in Michigan. But, yeah, so I, I really um, this picture here. <clears throat> excuse me, I totally apologize for the congestion. But the picture here, I didn't. I, I really um, took my time, went all out to um, get the get the skin colored. Uh, even her. Um, talons on the back of her arm um, came out really good but yeah well what, what I did different um, the one I did if, if you go back in my videos you'll see the um, actually I'll probably link to it um, at the end uh, do a link to the uh, previous video to show uh, what I did in this one that was different is I was able to I put the spots or scales on one layer and her skin on another which I 
didn't do any other one. I really paid for it in the coloring process. So live and learn. Like I tell my kids, practice makes perfect. So when you screw up, don't kick yourself. It just means you got to do better next time. So, yeah, th this one came out a lot better because I could actually shadow the scales how I wanted to without having them join in with the skin itself, which really irked me because I wanted a, a, a color on its own for the skin and the scales themselves needed to have a different color to um, shadow those around. So, all in all, I'm very pleasantly surprised that I remembered to uh, separate those on layers. And now with the uh, shirt, I went with a uh, more of a blue-green on that one to do the shadows. So it, was, it wasn't like a... I, I kind of cool, or a, yeah, cooled down the color a bit to um, for the shadows. And I was trying to add some highlights, but for some reason they weren't working out. So I kind of went against it. I put some, but not much for her shirt for the highlights. But I did um, add them to the swimsuit bottom, like you see here. Uh, yeah, but the, the, her gray hair, that, that's got to be the one of the most most fun parts to color. I was trying to figure out how I'd go hot or cold with her hair, and the red really didn't make sense, so I kind of went over it and um, you know, got rid of the red. And I, I did do two co copies of this picture that I'll um, post on here too um, as the um, video runs that um, I did one with just the sunset background and the other one I did with both the sunset and a wave um, kind of curling up and crashing behind her. So there's, it's kind of like I did a regular cover and then variant cover for the um, picture which I, I think is pretty neat. People seem to like the um, one without the wave more because I outlined her with the white and she seems to stand out better with the how you see it right now. So when you put that wave behind her, you kind of lose the um, white outline. But, you know, teach their own. Um, I, I like both, but I agree um, with most of the people that the uh, picture without the wave does seem to um, have, have more of a standout. So, like, I, I kind of got to give it to them. They, people got a keen eye. So, um, but yeah, the, but I, I'm definitely looking at doing a, um, either how to draw, how to color series, basically on how, what, what I do. Everybody's different, and I'm sure people wouldn't mind seeing exactly what it is that I do to go from start to finish, like, say, on a picture like this, you know, how many times you erase, you know, all, the, all those fun things that everybody goes through to complete their picture. But, yeah, you should be, uh, but I, I'll definitely put both pictures when I edit the video, put both pictures on there so you can see um, what I did for um, and how they um, compare to each other. Um, but if you like this video, um, give it a like. If you uh, want to see more, please click the subscribe button and ring the notification bell, and I will see you in the next video.